It's weird, usually when I interview, I say like as few things as possible. Just like sit there with a the camera, and follow and be like, what are you doing? <laughs> and like, if you watch my films, that's just what they're like. They're just people being like, I'm doing this stuff. Yeah. <laughs> right. A lot of what I've done so far has been solely online. Um, and I can see myself doing that for like a fair bit down the track kind of thing. And I think what online allows is that it's a bit more flexible and like it does put you in a situation where you can find a story and like I'm still in chats with like Charlie Phillips from The Guardian UK and you can quickly send something, say like this is a story, this is something you're interested in and yeah it allows for that very immediate process. I think for TV and broadcast like as there is so much time in pre-production sometimes stories can feel like they are like these reality stories in a way and that's all well and good for telling a story but I think for the work that I do uh, I really like observational stuff of like now and then and that quite often involves you getting in now and then I love jumping on like SBS on demand and just like going way back to the 70s and 80s where like docos were just you know a life in the world of like a cattle farmer up in the territory and it's just it's just that nowadays there has to be so much kind of like we've got to attach this like message and create this universe and it's like I think by doing that you can forfeit like like an eye into the world of Australia a little bit sometimes like in its own beauty I'd like to see more of that for me I found that there's an ample amount of like grants available I generally find that like when I finish up one project there's there's often like another grant application process there and like it keeps me kind of like busy a lot of the year which is good but I feel like perhaps uh, the industry could be a little bit more reactive like these grants kind of rely on like a story to be like thought upon in advance but like in documentary there's a lot of things that are happening now and then and if there was some kind of like funding to, to you know, act on these very immediate stories and situations, then I suppose that could only be a good thing. <laughs>